Now, as the effects of the coronavirus pandemic continue to take a toll on Kenyans, three little sisters of the poor orphanage for elderly persons in Tudor, Mombasa County, are appealing for financial assistance to enable them cater for elderly persons confined in their institution. The orphanage can no longer feed or cater for medical bills for the elderly owing to the economic effects of the pandemic. Receiving donations from well-wishers, Sister Grace Kenya, a non-caretaker at the institution, said the orphanage cannot afford to provide the much-needed care to the elderly due to lack of funds. Kenya said they used to move out of their home to beg for food and money in the streets, but they have been confined in the home, and their movement out has been curtailed by the COVID-19 pandemic. The nun now says that the home, which has about 70 elderly people, has been forced to open operate on a shoestring budget as it heavily relies on donations from well-wishers to stay afloat. According to Sister Grace, the home is in dire need of financial assistance to cater to medications of the elderly people with some suffering from diabetes and cancer. We have people who are suffering from diabetes, high blood pressure, if we ha even we have several cancer patients. All of these, they need medicine, they take medication every day. So if there is somebody there outside who would like to help us, you are always welcome. In the meantime, a group of residents from impoverished families in Thika, Kiambu County, have petitioned the government to expedite the arrest and prosecution of those who misappropriated COVID-19 funds. They want the government to ensure all persons involved in the alleged embezzlement of funds meant for COVID-19 response measures brought to justice. The residents from the sprawling Athena and Kiganjo slums maintained those who embezzled millions of dollars from the ministry of health scoffers cannot be allowed to walk scot free after causing death, suffering, confusion, and anxiety among Kenyans. Sasa hii pesa ya COVID inakuliwa na watu wako viti ya juu. Hawa watu wako na kazi, wako na pesa, lakini wanataka kufikia hii kitu kidogo, ile inasaidia watu wasiumie sana. Nigeoba serikali ifuatiria hiyo mambo, imake sure hiso pesa simepatikana na simerudishwa, Dio sifanye kasi yenye inastahili. Ju watu wanaumia kusema ukweli. Separately, Korea West residents in Migori County are faulting the area MP Mathias Robi for allegedly declaring the country is now COVID-19 free. The legislator allegedly condemned the Ministry of Health for allegedly duping Kenyans on the statistics from COVID-19. Kina kitendo ambacho mbunge wa hapa Korea West alifanya siku tatu zilizopita kuja kukanusha kwamba hakuna covid Kenya kwamba ni mambo ya ulagai hiyo nataka kusema kwamba hiyo ilikuwa ni projo yake kama mtu binafsi sio watu wa kuria tunalaani kitendo hicho cha mtu kusema kwamba hakuna corona kuria hiyo ni, ni mambo ambayo tunarudia kusema kwamba tunailaani Beatrice Getonyenge Teach Channel 1 News